This is the Beta FPV Meteor 75 Pro, and I'm going to tell you upfront that I am very impressed with the power and performance it offers. Let's dig in more, and let's go. Before we begin, let's look at the specs. The flight controller is the Beta FPV F4 1S cross style flight controller, which has a serial based EOLRS receiver. This is a very good thing as we will be able to flash our EOLRS firmware via Wi Fi and we don't have to be whole hostage by Beta Flight no more. And the camera and VTX are the CO3 and the MO3 combo. The MO3 VTX is directly soldered onto the flight controller and the CO3 camera is basically the plug and play. The cost for each is about $20 if you ever need a replacement. And next, the thing that makes this quad so unique is the size of the frame and props. The larger 75 mm frame can harness the 45 mm props, which by pairing with the 1102 22,000 kV motor, it really gives you a strong punch of thrust with, with just a slight push of your throttle. The battery tray is designed to hold a BT 2.0 500 milliamp battery or a, five, uh, or a 450 milliamp battery, but just not for the 300. As you can see, the size is different. So make sure you get the right one. You can get both these batteries at Beta FPV website, which should still be the cheapest option. Next, let's just go and see how it flies. Let's first start with an outdoor flight. At outdoors, this quad really shines. You immediately feel the difference of the power it has to offer. You can really do some serious echo tricks if you want to. The main difference to me is you get a lot more pull up recovery power after tricks. You will feel the quad being less heavy and you do not need as much altitude to get yourself back to track. Of course, it is obviously not comparable to a 5 inch freestyle drone that uses a larger motor and bigger batteries. but. I am still very impressed that this Bind and Fly 1S can achieve this level considering it's only 1S. The current tuning is Beta FPV stock tuning and the only thing I change is the rates. Also worth mentioning, if the noise level it's of the quad is something you are having concern like I do, this quad definitely is one of the quiet ones. You can barely hear it and this is very good if you live in the suburban area. My take is, when people don't hear you, one less reason they will complain and yeah, you can enjoy your flight. So next, let's switch to indoors. When flying the Meteor 75 Pro indoors, the power and the size will start by back. In my opinion, it's definitely flyable, but you can probably tell already that my throttle level is much, much lower and it's just a little bit harder to control and you need to pay extra attention when you increase the throttle level otherwise you will be shooting yourself to the roof and double slam back to the floor before you know it if you want to fly this mainly indoor the best way may be to going into beta flight and adjust the power level down to a bit and adjust it back when you feel more confident the larger frame also means it's slightly harder for you to fit in smaller gaps. Why? Because right now it is just bigger. <laughs> okay, so let's just head back to the bench and let's talk about my final thoughts. Okay, so we're back. And I will say I really enjoy flying this one and I was really, really impressed. And I think you will be too. And if your main fly ground is outdoor, then this one will not disappoint you. However, fair warning, Although I love Beta FPV products as they do make the best and fun flying whoops on the markets, their products are still pretty weak compared to other manufacturers. In my opinion, they are not rigid enough and you can get and some things can get damaged fairly easy. Why do I know? Just check out my channel and you will see I'm constantly fixing Beta FPV products and almost becoming a Beta FPV troubleshoot expert. So hey, Beta FPV, if you are listening, we love you, but please improve your quality. Okay, so let's go back to the topics. This quad is still very, very nice, and I think you will like it. All right, so this wraps us up this video today. And if you like my content, please help me subscribe. And if you have additional questions, please feel free to leave a comment at the comment section. And if you want to fix something from Beta FPV, probably check my channel to see if you can find an answer. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. I'm
contemplating all my time My thoughts make me tired Just running through my mind Wonder if there's peace that I could find Instead of always being on the ground I need a new purpose I'm looking for so much more Don't leave me here searching just what I'm longing for When times are getting crazy And everything seems hazy Is there some place for safety? Safety, I could go. Run away, run away. 